guys welcome back to my channel and in this video uh, 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 uh no let's do it again welcome back guys in the uh, do it again welcome back guys in this video i'm going to tell you how to enable ready boost in your pen drive in windows 10 okay guys so this video will be a short video because it's an easy process and it's not it will not take a lot of time to get configured to make your pen drive into a ready boost pen drive so without wasting time anymore let's get started so it's my this pc my computer so in this you will get to see your pen drive my pen drive is of 8 gb which is just 7.13 gb they are paying us okay in the properties you can go to ready boost and in that you will see the quantity of your ram my ram is 4 gb so it says 4094 mb so in that you will see the maximum limit of your ram if it is not that full you can just make this bar go to the maximum so then it will automatically come with to the use that use this device so you can just click on apply it will take less than 10 seconds to make it configure and it's done okay now your pen drive is a ready boost pen drive but what is the profit of making a pen drive into ready boost the profit of making a pen drive into ready boost is that will make your computer enhance your RAM from 4 GB or whatever you have, 8 GB, 16 GB, what will a person need? configure his pen drive into a RAM <laughs> for a person having RAM of 16 GB, ah, forget. Yeah, the ready boost makes your RAM enhance to more, uh, above 1 GB or 2 GB, like it becomes like my pen drive is 4 GB then your pen drive will then your RAM will become more than 1 GB or 2 GB it will become 6 actually it won't but it will help you run the applications that were not running before now it will run more smoother and better so it will make your computer enhance so that's all for today guys please subscribe Please like and do not dislike and please share this video as much as you can because I want more likes. Do whatever do you want with your subscribe button. What will it take for you to click on that subscribe button? Just two clicks. One on the scroll bar, one on the subscribe button. And do not dislike the video, only like because I know it will, you will like this video. Thank you for watching guys. Please ask.